I have an incredibly important task I need to remember to do. I've set it as a to-do item in iCal, but the standard alert in iCal is often easily overlooked, a tiny little window, a little beep that you can hardly hear. I really want to make sure that I remember this item. Here's my to-do item in iCal. I'm going to double click it so that I can edit. Beside Alarm, I'm going to choose Open File. It suggests iCal. I could do that, but I've got a couple of other files in mind. I'm going to choose Other. And I've made this file called alert.jpg. It's an image. I'm going to select that. I want it on the same day because I'm recording this right now and I want to show it to you. And I need to have the time as a few moments from now, I'm going to make it 20.55. I'm going to set a second alarm as well. Again, I'm going to choose to open file. Again, I'm going to choose the file that I want. And I've made this really annoying sound called wakey wakey. I'll select that one. Again, I want it in a few moments. Uh, just after the other alert, so I'll make that that time there. Close. And in fact, I can quit iCal, but I might just hide it for the purposes of this video. Now we just need to wait a moment until the alert triggers. I'm going to pause the video and come back when we see the alert. And here's the alert that I made. Remember that urgent task. As you can see, I made it a large dominant image and it fills the screen. I'm just going to quit that while we wait for the second alert to come up. Again, I'll pause the video. Wakey, wakey, you've got work to do. And there it was. I made a sound file that opens into iTunes and plays. And it was intended to be annoying. It could, of course, be a much longer sound file that would continue until it had really grabbed your attention. So let me bring iCal back again. Here it is. Remember, edit a to-do item or an appointment, and for the alarm, try Open File. And you can make whatever file suits you. If you're a Microsoft Word user, do something in Microsoft Word if you like to play with Photoshop or sounds or any other kind of files, just make a file that works for you. Do visit the tip over at the MacTips.info website and leave some comments. Tell us how you've used the open file alarm on iCal. See you later.